during Jesus' time of ministry, he, he paints some amazing pictures for us about what it means to live and walk in relationship to him. Jesus also understood that this life would not be easy and he wanted his followers to be able to find rest, to be able to find peace even in the difficult times of life. One of his beautiful pictures he paints is this idea of yoking up with him. Now for his audience, this picture would have made great sense because they understood that you would yoke two oxen together with, with a wood beam across their necks and, and together the two oxen could perform and farm and, and plow land in ways one oxen just couldn't do. They could accomplish so much more together. Well, Jesus says, I want you to have the privilege, the opportunity to yoke up with me and I'll carry burdens that overwhelm you. Listen to his words. We find them in Matthew chapter 11, verses 28 and 29. Come to me, all of you who are weary and burdened, and I will give you rest. Take my yoke upon you and learn from me, for I am gentle and humble in heart, and you will find rest for your souls. I just want to encourage us. I think so often we feel alone, like we're navigating through challenging waters without anybody to rescue us and comfort us and walk with us. And Jesus is saying that doesn't have to be the case. He's not forcing us to yoke up with him. That's the beauty of our Lord and Savior. He's saying, I want to yoke up with you. Come to me and I will give you rest. I'll carry the burdens that are overwhelming you right now if you lean into me, if you come to me. So I want to encourage us as we think about today and this week, what does it look like for you to yoke up with Jesus, to give your burdens to him and let him carry the load that is overwhelming? That's what he longs to do. It's not a hopeful idea. He says, I will give you rest for your souls. All I ask of you is to come to me, yoke up with me, let me walk with you, and carry the very things that feel overwhelming and daunting to you. Jesus never wanted his followers to feel anxious and overwhelmed by their circumstances. And he also assured them that I want to walk with you and in this life I'll never leave you. So I just want to encourage you. Think about what it means for you and for me to yoke up with Jesus this week. God bless you. May you find rest for your soul. And we'll see you again soon.